Hey, what's up guys, Jakey here. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you how to download and import skins into Osu. So when you first download a skin, the most common types of files it will come in is either an OSK file, a zip file, or just a folder. OSK files are super simple, this is what they look like. It's basically the same as importing a beatmap. All you have to do is double click on it and it will open Osu automatically and import itself. So just like this, you just double click on it and wait for a second and it will disappear and open up Osu just like that. As you can see, if we go to my skins, it's imported right here. If your OSK file doesn't look like this, you might have to right click on it, go to properties, and then click under here where it says opens with. If you don't see Osu here, then you have to click on change and find Osu. So if you don't see it right here in this menu, then you're gonna, you're gonna have to scroll all the way down and click for on look for another app on this PC. Once you click on this, just go to where you installed Osu and find the EXE and double click on it. And then it should be set to Osu and you should be good to go. Okay, so the next format that skins can come in is a zip file. And you will need an unzipping program like WinRAR or 7-Zip uh, in order to open these. So when you get a zip file, just there's two versions that you can get, just double click on it to check which one you have. The first one is going to be where all the assets are inside the zip, like this. So you have the whole skin, every asset just straight inside the zip file. If you get this version of the zip, all you need to do is change the extension to .osk. Um, and as you can see, once you change the extension, it will basically become an OSK like the first file we had. And it's again, super simple. You just double click. Um, if you don't see the extension, all you have to do is open up your file explorer. Once you're in your file explorer, go over to view. And then under file name extensions, just check this and you will be able to see the extensions of your files. Okay, so the second variation of the zip is where the skin is inside of a folder um, inside of the zip. And this brings me on to my, the third format, which is just if you download a skin and it comes in a folder. So if the skin comes in a folder um, and you double click on it and all the assets are inside just like this, all you need to do is go over to your OSU directory Alright guys, so I have my OSU directory open here, and basically once you have your OSU directory open, you just want to go to find your skins folder, double click on it, and all of your skins that you have downloaded should be inside this folder, and all you need to do is take this folder and drag it into your skin folder. So it's in there now, and if you have OSU open, you want to restart your game. If it's not open, once you launch the game, you should see this skin in here just like normal. Um, and if it's inside of a zip file like this, so let me delete this real quick. If it's inside of a zip file and you see a folder, all you need to do is extract this folder from the zip file into your skins folder inside of your OSU directory. And there we go. So now I'm going to launch the game. As you can see, I launched the game. I go to my skins and here it is. That's pretty much it guys. That was how to import skins into Osu with the most common file types and how to import them. Um, I hope this video helped you guys out and I will see you in the next one. If you have any questions, go ahead and leave them in the comments. And uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. Leave a like, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace out.